Breaking Bad. Walter, put your dick away, Walter. Jesse, we have to cook. Hey, Miss White. Better Call Saul. Imagine telling someone in 2008 that in 2022, the most popular show would still be Breaking Bad. I'd be inclined to believe you. It's a pretty good show. Look, we all know why it's popular right now, again, today, as you watch this. There is no point in the show where Mike tells Walter to put his, but I couldn't, it was early August. I couldn't go anywhere without seeing this. Mike saying this to Walter, this exact video. And that was when I said, look, Look, I consider myself to be a, a bit of a, a YouTube voice actor, but sometimes I accidentally make longer videos like this one. I had done a, a bit of Hank, a bit of Saul, a bit of Jesse, a bit of Walt, but I wanted to make the perfect Breaking Bad meme. How do I do it? How did I do it? I think I ended up doing it. It did pretty well. You know, I made a lot of friends along the way. Some of you guys maybe even watching this came from it. But anyone can do it. Any, anyone can do People it. People telling me my Hank is a little better than my mic, but yeah, I'm still working on it. It's not the impression that matters. It's not, it's not, you don't need to sound exactly like the guy that matters. And I'll get to that. Here's how I made the perfect Breaking Bad meme. And believe me, the, the process was anything but straightforward. Look, when you start, you gotta get into it. You gotta get into the character. I, I saw this, this meme that was circulating and I wanted to, to think about how would it work in universe? What if one of these characters discovered that they had become a meme? How would they react? What would they say? What would they do with their hands? There's a lot of, a lot of this. So I do my vocal warm-ups, my articulation. She sells seashells by the seashore. You gotta get in the headspace. You gotta get in the hair character. You gotta walk around. You gotta jump. You gotta do your your stretches. And then oh god, oh here it comes. You think no one's gonna watch this? Why am I even doing this? My channel's dying. You put your head on the desk. Everything's hopeless. But you gotta get back in the character jump around a few more times go in circles and then read that comment read that comment from like a year ago that says you're a voice actor and it inspires you to keep going lift your head back off your desk you're in character now every good meme needs a good script you need to leave if you don't have a script i can't sound exactly like jonathan banks i can't sound exactly like brian cranston and you can't either but you know what you can do Mannerisms. Mannerisms. Sometimes Brian Cranston does this. He put this like this. And when Jonathan Banks is talking, he has his eyes lowered. Jesse has his shoulders up and he's got his hat and he goes, he's like a bending down. That's a bit exaggerated, but what comedy is, what comedy, the, the, the joke is in the exaggeration. You gotta exaggerate in order to get the joke, in order to get, get the comedy, get the memes, get the views, get the subs. That's what you're doing here. These characters live in a universe that has been shaken up by this video that's circulating. Walter. What does he think? What does he, what does he want to do next? What is he gonna tell Walt? What's he gonna tell Saul? These are questions for you, for the script writer. I was walking around in circles at work when this script popped into my head. Stop what you're doing, go in the break room, take your 15, get on your phone, put it all in Google Docs. You gotta get this down now before it escapes your head and you can never find it again. Half of the creative process is just writing things down before you forget them. Now, I don't know if you could tell, but I didn't write any of the, 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 this down before recording it. And you can probably tell because- I'm All right, you got it, you got it, good. Now you keep it under a minute, keep it under a minute. And guess what? Wait, I forgot. You don't need over a minute. You don't even need, need out of there. Keep it around a minute. I can't remember right now if the meme I made was over a minute. It was around a minute. You don't want a 10 minute, seven minute meme. They'll leave that to Uncle Al. Keep it snappy. Keep it quick. Keep it fresh. You want something nobody's ever seen before. Nothing that has ever been done before, but you want to use these characters? Use your mannerisms. Get in character when you're recording these lines. Listen through your headphones, the lines you've already recorded so you can respond to them like you're having a real conversation. You get it in your head here, you're in character, you have just one or two solid recording sessions edited together, and you got it. Actually, you don't got it, because then you need to add a title, thumbnail, and keywords. This part's sad. This part's very sad. This part's depressing. Here's the thing about YouTube titles. Most of the time, it doesn't matter, because it's the thumbnail that matters. And here's the thing about thumbnails. If you don't have a good thumbnail, then the title isn't going to carry your video anyway. What makes a good title? What makes a good thumbnail? you got to create intrigue. And you want to make them think that they have to watch it. They have to know what makes Walter Put Your D Away the worst meme. 
Why? They've been seeing it everywhere. They want to see these characters in universe react to this meme. What's going on? What's going to happen next? Add your impact font, top and bottom. You need the impact font. You need those captions. What if someone's watching in the grocery store and they can't turn the volume on? They need those captions. They're not going to hear your beautiful voice, but they're going to need those captions. Some people like to put still images of the characters on these. I put videos. It's dynamic. It's moving. It's all over the place. And then snap. It's uploaded. And you wait. 200,000 views later, you have made the perfect Breaking Bad meme. So that's how I did it. Let me know how you'll do it in the comments down below. I've been Joey. Uh,